Almost a year ago, 25-year-old Monica Awalith barely knew how to bake. Now though, her baking skills are sharper thanks to a 12-week hands-on baking course run by South Korean troops deployed to South Sudan's Bo town. At first, I thought I was just to come here to pass my time, but I realized this, my dream might be. So, doing a lot of baking, with the new instructors coming, I gain more experience and a lot of information on how to bake. She has been training on baking cakes, baguettes, Swiss rolls, brownies, bread and donuts, among other assorted confectionaries. And now, there's reason to smile. I don't like cooking that much. So, but lately, when I cooked, and most of my customers, they said, what you are cooking is so tasteful. It make me more excited, and I will even be proud to tell them that I'm the one doing it. So, that's make me happy and I'm enjoying doing what I'm doing. Monica is on an extended bakery training program at this vocational training center working on perfecting her skills alongside five other students. Classes begin every day at 8.30 a.m. in a spotless fully equipped kitchen stocked with brand new baking utensils and ovens shipped straight from Korea. The tutor at this bakery class is 22-year-old Gu Janon, who is also a student in global Korean cuisine back home. Little did he know that he would be sent to serve as a peacekeeper in conflict-afflicted South Sudan when he was enlisted in the military. Korean peacekeepers have been serving in South Sudan as engineers since 2013 and have been running a vocational training center aimed at developing self-sustaining basic skills amongst young South Sudanese nationals since April 2016. For beneficiaries like Monica, both the baking and life skills learned from their Korean peacekeeping tutor has impacted positively on various aspects of life. We are so happy that most of the men are coming to our class now and in our traditions it is against our culture for a man to cook but now they are changing like now we have one guy with us, two, two actually. So and also it's bring unity because we have different people from a different state and especially some are from POC and the one from Bo Town. So it's kind of unity we try to learn from each other. Besides baking, Monica has been tasked with additional responsibilities as a manager at the vocational training center's market where she sells various groceries including what the students bake, some of which is baked on order. She also benefited from various bookkeeping courses. For many South Sudanese youth, a protracted conflict has dealt a heavy dent on their hopes and dreams. But with their newfound appreciation for baking skills obtained at this training center, Monica believes that nothing will stop her from rolling out her dream within the next two years.